Once upon a time, Don Juan and his wife Nei Bungan live in Nao Buin, now part of La Union in the northern part of the Philippines. By the way, Namongan, I have a plan tonight. I'm going to the mountain and I'm going to punish all the eager enemies. Okay, Juan, just please take care of yourself and come back early. Don Juan left his wife and went to the mountain in order to punish a group of their Igrit enemies. But he didn't know that his wife is already pregnant. While he was away, his son Lam Ang was born. As soon as the baby popped out, he spoke and asked that he would be given the name Lam Ang. He also asked his mother where his father was. Mother, name me Lam Ang. My son, look! A newborn baby just fought. It's a miracle. Mom, can I ask you something? Of course, my son. What is it? I want to see my dad. Where is he? As I know, your father was a brave man. He tried to punish our enemies, the Igorots. So when will he come back? I don't know, my son. After nine months, Lam Ang decided he would go and look for his father. During his exhausting journey, he decided to rest for a while. He fell asleep and had a dream about his father's head being stuck on a pole by the Igorots. Lam Ang was furious when he learned about what happened to his father. He rushed to the village and killed them all except for one one he let go so that he could tell other people about Lam Ang's greatness. Hey, the three of you, I want you to fight me! Upon returning to Nalbuan in triumph, he was bathed by the women in the Amborayan River. All the fish died because of the dirt and odor from the man's body. Oh, what happened to the fish? The fish are dying. Oh, so oh, poor fish. There was a young woman named in his canoe and whom Lam Ang wanted to woo. Lam Ang met his enemy Sumarang, another suitor of Innes. Yo, Lam Ang, I challenge you in a battle. The winner will get the heart of the net. I accepted your challenge. Lamang defeated Sumarang in one strike. Lamang found the house of Ayanis surrounded by many suitors, all whom were trying to catch her attention. We will let you to marry her with the proper dory. I will promise, when Ines and I got married, that will happen. Okay, good. The biggest day of Lam Ang and Ines happened in their wedding day. I'm so happy Lam Ang that now we are married. Me too, Ines. I promise to you that I love you forever. It was a tradition that a newly married man will swim in the river to get the raring fish. Unfortunately, Lam Ang dived straight into the mouth of water monster Burkhagen. Oh no! My husband is eaten by Burkhagen! Ines, wait here. I'll be back. I'll get 
Marcos open the stomach of water monster Burkaken. He get Lemang's bone which Ienes covered with a piece of cloth. His rooster crowed and the dog barked and slowly the bones started to move. Back a love. Lamang and his wife lived happily ever after with his white rooster and grey dog.